Launching the operation, Deputy Inspector General for Operations at the Namibian Police noted that the crime prevention operation will be spearheaded by the Namibian Police, leading members of the Namibia Defence Force, the Namibian Correctional Service and the Windhoek Municipal Police Service. This is another effort to improve our global competitiveness and enhance accessible qualitative public service. We vow to be conducting robust and visible beat patrols in towns, suburbs, streets, highways, and localities with a view to prevent and combat crime, protect human lives and property. Enforcing laws of this country ranging from prevention and or combating of crime particularly gender-based violence, murder, rape, robberies, road accidents, as well as the enforcement of members of the society to adhere to the COVID-19 health measures and regulations. The operation will be concentrated in the areas of crime prevention, road accident prevention and road safety maintenance, and COVID-19 prevention. On the COVID-19 situation the country as you all know has started to experience a rise in COVID-19 cases which is a serious concern and is posing a serious threat to the livelihood of many in terms of health and economy. Therefore we need to be responsible citizens in order to curb the further spread of this virus. On the gender-based violence and overall crime we should make sure as law enforcers that our visibility throughout the throughout day and night are felt everywhere countrywide on road accidents over the past festive season namibia has recorded a high number of road accidents and it has affected the livelihoods of many people this time around our strategy to curb road accidents will be to deploy as many traffic officers as possible along our national roads who will be equipped with modern addition of breathalyzers to test those that are driving under the influence of alcohol. I can assure you these are modern equipment that are free from uh, vulnerability of the COVID spread. Members of various forces to take part in the operation have also been directed to undergo induction on conduct and rules of engagement. The forces will further be briefed and debriefed on their daily duties.